So this, this is an industrial hemp crop and it actually is very resilient. This, this was a couple of weeks ago, our track of, um, of where we used to water. This crop is just a pure herd and fibre crop. Probably there'll be 10 houses in this. Let's call it my housing estate. <laughs> This crop was planted about 40 kilo per the hectare, and then 14 weeks is what you get behind us. To cut this down, I hand harvested the first crop. I pulled every single one of them out by hand, and this is how we harvest it. One, two, three. Ah, yeah. How do you go through here? You can see the resilience of these plants. Now, these have been run over by a tractor. Look at that, that is just totally split. You know, and that's all that's cellulose going in there. To be able to even just regrowing, this would be fine. It's one of nature's super plants. Now you'll see here in this section, weeds, no weeds. So this is what this whole crop would look like if we were, had it all spaced out and we're doing a seed crop. Because we're growing a fibre crop, and you'll see inside of there, all the dead shade leaves, all of these, are covering the ground. Whatever you plant after this crop is going to grow far better because you will have no weeds and no chemicals put back into the soil. You can make some really good money as a farmer, you know, changing your practices. Now to put this in even as a rotational cropping system, you can move away from chemical farming. And the proof's right here. So you're going to reduce your cost by chemical farming, you're putting high nitrogen back into your soil, and for rotational cropping, you're going to get a better yield. So it becomes a real no-brainer for an agricultural industry. We're growing this for housing. You've seen the soil. It's doing everything great for the soil. We're not using any chemicals on this land whatsoever. It's fully organic. This house will be the first fully grown organic hemp home.